Black Friday is around the corner and we all know that's the best time of the year for e-commerce stores to increase sales, acquire more customers and really to have the best excuse of the year to promote their products and give discounts, etc. And that's why today I'm making this video on a proper Black Friday plan. Because most of brands, what they would do is they would just have a few emails set for the 26, 27 and a couple of ads programmed as well for the 26, 27 and, and a banner on the website, but that's all. And the problem with that is you can't differentiate yourself this way. So your emails are going to be on their inbox alongside with 20 other brands emails on Black Friday. Same with ads the CPMs are going to go way higher because all brands in the world are literally launching the same ads uh, on the same day. And the problem is it's hard to send out, you pay a lot more for ads, you, you simply can't send out and the results won't be that great. And to, to mitigate that, to solve that, what we did is we created a whole strategy, a mar really like a Black Friday calendar with actions you can take to create the biggest Black Friday event ever. And what I mean by a Black Friday event is to create your own event. So let's say, for example, you sell baby products. Instead of calling it Black Friday, why not call it the, the, the baby Friday or the baby week? Something unique for your situation that's going to draw a lot more attention than simply Black Friday, which is what everyone does. So let me present to you so here's the marketing calendar. This is a simple uh, calendar on Google Calendar where you can add here uh, and at the end of the video, I'm going to give it to you the template for the planning. But uh, as you can see, it all starts in September. Granted, we are already in October. This video may be a little late, but nonetheless, it's good to start planning uh, beforehand so that when the time comes, you have everything ready and you can uh, have everything checked and perfectly set to launch. But um, on, this, on September, you want to plan out some logistical stuff, what will be the event. So for example, the, the baby week, the baby Friday, uh, the budget you want to spend. And for budget, you want to spend something that, uh, of course, that you can afford perfectly, but you can also expect a return of three to 10 times that amount after I show you the whole uh, structure of lead generation. So I, I'm getting ahead of myself here, but you understand in a second. And also plan stock and logistics. So for Black Friday, what you wanna do is have at least 50% more stock than usually, because there's going to be a peak in sales and you really, really don't wanna run out of stock, at least in your best seller products, uh, also known as your A curve. And Finally, the defined timelines, but the defined timelines we already did for you with this marketing calendar. Uh, moving forward to October, on the 1st of October, what we want is to plan the deliverables and deadlines. So really define what advertising content we need, what ads we need, what banners we need, what videos we need, and define the emails to be sent. Because one thing I can say, you're going to be sending a lot of emails in November, so it's great to have them uh, scheduled and ready beforehand. Okay, and it all starts um, here in October where you're going to be planning out what's going to happen. So the first thing you have to have done in October is to have a Black Friday sign up landing page. And why you have to have a landing page, a sign up landing page, because throughout uh, 1st of November, all the way to 24th, we'll be capturing leads. We'll be capturing what will soon be your customers, what will soon be your Black Friday VIP list, it's what we call here, okay? But I'm going to get there. First, let's focus on October. So for October, what you want to have is to have a Black Friday sign up landing page ready and live. This landing page is a dedicated page on your web a site made to collect the name and email of those interested in your Black Friday event. Okay, the page should be clearly should clearly describe what the event consists of and what benefit they will get by signing up. 
So you have to give them some incentive. Why am I subscribing to this baby week or this baby Friday? Uh, what I'm going to get? So here's a catch. You have to give them something special that uh, like the, the open audience won't have. For example, early access. So on the 25th of November, you can start your, your event. And that's great because few brands start there early. So if you start on the 25th, you can give them uh, early access. And that's great. Also exclusive product. Maybe you're going to launch something only for the list or you're going to restock your bestseller only for this list. That's also great. Uh, better discount. So instead of giving 30, you're going to give them 35, 40. That's also good. Okay. As for the page structure, what you want to have here is a headline with the event's name. So your event's name on top, the baby Friday, for example, a catchy subheading with the date. So from November 25th, all the way uh, from November 25th, have access to our black week before everyone else that gives them a reason to sign up a clear benefit for them to sign up for your black Friday list. Then if you want a short paragraph with information on how it's going to work. So be very clear. If you sign up, you get a code via email or via uh, SMS before everyone else where you can go into the store and purchase whatever you want at black Friday discount, but before and the, the advantage is that everyone else, uh, you know, you don't run the risk of getting to the website on black Friday and your favorite product is out of stock, something along those lines. And finally, a lead form that's uh, key here, uh, where you're going to be collecting their first name and their email. And if you want some themed product images, um, just black Friday stuff, just some some banners, just something to show kind of your products and what you, will be happening. Once the person is subscribed, uh, they should be directed to a thank you page with a confirmation message and the details of the event once again. Okay, this thank you page is key. Let them know they are subscribed. Let them know they are enrolled. A great thing to do is to add your Instagram link to the thank you page with a call to action. Follow us to be in the loop about the sale. That way you're going to uh, have a double benefit here. Not only you get customers signing up for your Black Friday, but you also be uh, increasing the number of followers on your Instagram. Okay. Uh, also have the lead generation advertising content ready. A uh, key part in this process is the ads. Uh, are the ads, the advertising, Facebook, Google, Pinterest, uh, TikTok ads you're going to be running because that's where you're going to bring new people into your event. Okay, not only do you want to leverage your uh, list you already have, but you also want to bring new people in through the lead generation I'm about to show you. So for uh, advertising content, what you need pretty much is uh, images with uh, like baby Friday, sign up to early access to our biggest uh, sale of the year. So just you know, state that clearly in the image and run those as Facebook. And, and, and Google Ads. Uh, then moving forward to November, that's when the magic really happens. So this is where we start our lead generation. And the reason why lead generation is so important with Black Friday is that you are pretty much uh, hacking the, the, the sale and you're going to be paying a very cheap price on your ads to bring a lot of people in that would otherwise be very expensive to acquire during the actual Black Friday event. You are creating a lot of anticipation, you are hyping them up for the sale and you are collecting new email addresses for your list that you can remarket to whenever you want for free. Okay, that's why you have to have like this lead generation going on. And the goal is to get as many people as possible to sign up for a Black Friday email list. Once signed up, they'll get anticipation, anticipated access to Black Friday discounts, usually on the 25th, or other benefits such as better discounts, access to exclusive products, etc. We already touched on that. Okay. And the first thing you want to do here is email to your full list. So you, you have your list of newsletter, uh, other sales, 
like your your full email list just send them an email for them to sign up for the vip blacklist uh black friday list okay an email to send to all email lists, customers, newsletter, etc., promoting the Black Friday event. Have a clear call to action for them to subscribe to the VIP Black Friday list and have a button leading to the sign up page. So just a simple email explaining what the what the, 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 the your event is going to consist of, and then you have a call to action sign up by clicking here. Once they click, they go to the landing page you previously created. Okay? And then uh, just keep the lead generation going and throughout all this period, there's going to be Facebook and Google ads running, bringing new people in, bringing new leads in, sending them to the landing page and they will be signing up for your event. You can expect to pay anywhere from one to three dollars per lead, which is a great deal given that about 20% of them will buy on Black Friday. Okay, so it's the greatest return on ad spend you ever have throughout the year so you know you can easily put uh, a lot of money here and you will see good returns um, same thing just November 1st just send this email same thing on the 7th uh, and here you will already have a good list size of people signed up for the Black Friday event so what you want to start doing here is hyping them up for the actual sale so email to the VIP Black Friday list, highlighting the event, the discounts, new products, also detailing the early access on the 25th. So they have this exclusive benefit, let them know they have it and hype them up for the sale that's coming. Okay, so that they know and they are ready to buy once it comes out. Same thing, just keep going with the lead generation on your ads, then coming to the 14th, Email to the full list to sign for the VIP list once again. And here just some warnings just on, on the 15th, you want to already have early Black Friday advertising content ready. Those are the ads that's going to be launched on the 25th and is going to be running only for the 25th. And also the emails, okay, have the emails ready for the early Black Friday. Those emails will be sent on the 25th at midnight and, uh, you know, you can send multiple of those throughout the day. Uh, also, same thing, but this time for the actual Black Friday event, the one that's open to the public, uh, just have everything ready, like one week in advance, more than one week in advance, just to make sure, uh, you know, you won't run the risk of forgetting it or uh, don't have any time to uh, produce them. Once again, hype the list up again. The Black Friday is coming. It's in one week. It's one. It's in uh, eight days, etc. Here on the 19th, what you have to do is have all your ads, emails, SMS, etc. is scheduled and approved. The reason why is because. If you delay and then just launch the ads and on the 25th, there's going to be two things that happen. One, all the platforms are going to be a mess because again, everyone will be launching their ads on the 25th and 26th. And the problem is the platforms will likely go down and there's going to be a lot of instability. And also the Facebook team and the Google team will have a lot of ads to approve and it may take uh, 12, um, 25 uh, 24 hours to approve and by then uh, your early black friday will be over already um, we've seen it take all the way up to 48 hours to approve an ad for black friday and so you pretty much lost uh 40 percent of your black friday sales just by not having this uh things scheduled so always have them in advance in advance uh, then keep the lead generation going another hype email very close to the sale on the 23rd and 24th and then that's when you end the the lead generation campaigns and emails and you actually start the, the sale you actually start your event so here is the early black friday for the vip list only Okay, so exclusive early access discount code only for VIP Black Friday list. 
the code can be as simple as early VF. Okay, you send this to, to them through an email, maybe even through ads, but make sure you only send those ads to that list with the code they can use to have this early access. Okay, you should make a good portion of your uh, Black Friday revenue on the 25th alone, which is uh, when most brands are not even running their ads yet, and therefore uh, the CPMs are, are lower, uh, your role is going to be great. Okay, then 26, 27, 28, 29, just, you know, uh, announce your public break Black Friday. A Black Friday discount available for everyone. One thing here, one nuance here is recommendable to have the discount applied automatically site-wide. Don't give them discounts, don't give them codes, don't give, uh, sorry, don't give them codes or coupons because there's always issues with that. Maybe they, they write wrong, they don't purchase, etc. So just have the discount applied site-wide so that no one has to do anything and you know, maybe even add a, a bar on top saying 20% uh, off site-wide, no code needed applied on checkout and so this is your black friday this is how you should plan things up always plan in advance so that when you get to the actual black friday you have everything perfectly set and planned and ready and scheduled okay this is how you are going to make the biggest black friday ever by leveraging anticipation in this event this big event idea Okay, um, that's pretty much it for this video. I hope you found value. I hope you can implement that. If you want, um, if you want this marketing calendar, the template, this is not only for Black Friday, but this is for the whole year. We have uh, plannings and we have uh, tasks for the whole year. So Halloween, we have tasks uh, and, and plannings and lead generation and, 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 and this planning. We have for Christmas, which is very important to have planning. We have for the months where usually you don't sell a lot. We have we have for the full year. So this is a really solid marketing calendar. It's a template. As you can see, you can just uh, add them to your uh, calendar. And if you want the link for that, I'm going to make that available on uh, the Grow Your Store Facebook group, which is a Facebook group we are developing now. Uh, we just created it and it's going to be Huge is going to be the biggest community for e-commerce owners to learn and to get support on how to advertise their stores, how to plan promotions, um, product selection, offers, etc. The whole thing, a high quality uh, Facebook group community for e-commerce owners, store owners, and that's going to be huge. Okay, so the link's going to be in the description. Uh, you can join, just the, the selection process is really, uh, we really vet very well or or uh, uh, people that's that are going to be on that group to make sure there's only high level e-commerce founders no service providers selling you stuff no beginner drop shippers etc no um, you know no spammers just a very high quality group only with uh, the best e-commerce founders out there to share experiences we also going to have q a calls free q a calls with our team we spent millions on advertising for e-commerce stores we're going to be uh answering your questions there also there's going to be a lot of good stuff there so the link's going to be in the description just click it answer the questions the qualifying questions and hopefully you will get approved and i'm going to send you over this uh marketing calendar template right here okay also if you don't have the time to plan it out on your own, if you don't know how to run the ads, if you don't know how to schedule, how to how to run Facebook, Google ads, I, I have no idea how I'm going to put that into action. The second link in the description is going to be for my agency. We are a performance team that guarantees to get you uh, better ad results than you're currently getting. And we guarantee to get you profitable results. So definitely check that out if you want help planning for your Black Friday. Okay, we expect this year to be the biggest uh, event ever, the biggest November ever for our clients, and I'd be happy to do that for you as well. With that said, thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any questions, any, any questions, just drop in the comment section. I will be happy to uh, reply to all of them. You can also 
uh, ask your questions on the Facebook group. Uh, all the resources in this video will probably be there as well. Just go there, ask and uh, myself or my team or other uh, e-commerce founders are going to uh, reply and uh, you know network and it's going to be great. Okay, thanks so much for watching and I hope to see you there. Bye-bye.